Hi everyone, welcome to this Seesaw tutorial on how to set up skills. My name is Dan, if you're on Twitter or Instagram you can follow me at PonderingDan. Um, you can also check out my blog PonderingDan.com. So let's get straight into this video. We're going to show you how you can set up a skill using Seesaw. So what we want to do, we want to go into our settings up on the top right hand corner of our screen and we want to scroll down until we find Manage Skills. Down the bottom here we want to press on the new skill button and then we just want to type in what we're calling our um, skill that we're assessing. So for this one here we're doing a response to literature. So I'm just going to call this book review. Our subject is reading and our category is responding to literature. This is an activity for a grade 2 class. Um, and you have an option for a quick code there if you want to use one. Um, for this one, I might just call this uh, Responding to Literature 1. Um, the description here is simply, um, you can put anything in there. So for this, because our skills are rated out of uh, four stars, you can put in what one star might look like, two, three, and four, etc. Um, for this one, because I have gotten some of the details straight from our curriculum, I'm going to put in our curriculum codes so that if a different teacher looks at it, they know exactly where they can go and they know which part of the reporting requirements it belongs to. And I'm also going to put this in for, I'm just going to make this out of three stars. Um, so one star means they're working towards uh, the standard. Um, two is that they have achieved standard and three stars would be working beyond standard. All right, and you press the tick up the top. And there you have it, your skill has just appeared at the bottom of the list here, and that's how you set up a skill using Seesaw.